Excuse me. You need to wear a mask. Do you understand that? To come You're in the violating my constitution. Okay, well, this is private property. This private fucking property has food. I have a right to buy the food. There's no constitutional liberty right that allows one person to do anything they want, even if it puts other people in danger. Courts have long recognized that the government's power to control its citizens changes remarkably during a time of pandemic or some other public health emergency. And that sometimes the government has to force its citizens to do things and wear things that in normal non-emergency situations, the government probably couldn't do. No one's rights are being violated by a requirement to wear a face covering in a store. Stores are private property. And if the store wants, it can require people to wear funny hats when they come in. The reality is nobody's going to shop at that store if they have a funny hat requirement. Yes, you have a general constitutional freedom of speech, but wearing a face covering is not about speech. It's about safety. I have a breathing problem. The Americans with Disabilities Act was enacted to ensure that individuals with disabilities are not treated differently and are not segregated or excluded. I've not seen any evidence yet that an individual who is disabled has a problem wearing a mask. And if there were, then the government building, the grocery store that's covered by the act needs to offer a reasonable accommodation. Hi, I have a medical condition that I'm not allowed to wear a mask and I'm not required by HIPAA rule, r rules and regulations to okay. disclose that. Okay, can we shop for you? So, um, what does that look like? We I have private things I want to get, but maybe I don't want you to shop see. For you, but I can't let you in the store without a mask. The store employee said, we are able to accommodate you with shopping for you. That is an offer of a reasonable accommodation. The store doesn't have to have an unlimited number of accommodations. They just need to offer a reasonable accommodation. HIPAA laws probably don't apply when a person walks into a store and another person asks them for their reason for not wearing a face covering. That's because HIPAA really deals with the dissemination of medical records from medical providers. It doesn't prohibit one person from asking another person on the street, hey, why aren't you wearing a mask? And all of us are having to understand public health in ways perhaps that we never understood before. And are we now going to ask businesses to have to know HIPAA? It, it's a tough world. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.